Hey, what's up, guys? And what's up, Sussex Squad? Y'all, they talking about Kate Middleton has been spotted for the first time since her abdominal surgery. And all I want to say is, is this the best they got? Y'all, look at these pictures. It's giving, do you think I'm dumb? It's giving Weekend and Bernie's. It's giving, this look like Pippa in her sunglasses. And she even has a tan fresh off of her holiday. Y'all, what is going on in the royal family? How do they think these pop shots are going to work? First of all, let's read the, uh, let's read what they're actually trying to say. Okay. Princess Kate Middleton was spotted out and about for the first time following her month's long recovery from abdominal surgery. The Princess of Wales was seen in the car with her mom, Carol Middleton. Oddly enough, Carol's been missing too, and we're finally seeing her. On Monday, March 4th, and photos attained by TMZ, Kate Middleton. <laughs> okay, you guys, let me break this down how it works for you. The British media has a lock on the UK. The British royal family have a lot of power with that. No unauthorized shots of the royals can come out without their permission at all. And when I say at all, I mean at all. TMZ is giving these photos, which look a lot like Pippa. That is Pippa's nose. I don't care what you say. And here's the thing. Oh, my God. Let me get into this. I have so many thoughts. I feel like I should write them down, okay? First of all, this is Pippa's nose, okay? You can't tell me it's not. How did TMD backgroup photographers get allowed into UK, take pictures of the royal family, get permission to print the pictures. All because the whole world's been screaming, where is Kate Middleton? Now, I don't care what you guys say. This does not look like Kate Middleton to me. It's giving weekend and Bernie's. Kate had abdominal surgery. How are you sitting upright in a car, but you need all these months of recovery? And if you are well, but you know what? Let's roll it back some because this isn't an official photo. This isn't an official outing. This is nothing sanctioned officially by the palace. So what does that tell you? Well, it tells you a couple of things because baby, I know the way the British media plays with this. When nothing is official from the palace, they use it as a way to roll back things. You get that? They use it as a way to roll back. Okay. Okay. Fine. So they can always walk out of stuff. But hear me out because this is what I think is the plan. First of all, anybody with two eyes can tell this is Pippa. She even has the tan from the vacation. This is weird that they would try to pass this off. They trotted Pippa out in sunglasses because in sunglasses, Kate and Pippa do favor each other. However, there are big differences. This looks like Pippa to me. So why would they release this? Because the whole world's been asking, where's Kate? So they think by releasing this photo, and again, this is a planned photo op. And if you are having planned photo ops, then what? Because it is because they need a permission to one, photograph it, and to take it. Let's not forget they are, she is on a royal estate. They are not running errands, right? It's all set up. You don't just take paparazzi photos of the future queen out in the country. So the re if you could stage this, then why can't we have an official photo? Or when I say official, just something more. I'll tell you why. Because an official photo would make them liars. Because an official photo would draw questions when we hear the truth that's going to come out soon. Because an official photo does not let them have any leeway. When it comes to the Brits, you have to look at what they say officially. So why do Pippa? Because they think it's going to be distraction. Because they think people are going to fall for it. That's why they're doing this Pippa stuff. But more importantly, they made it released unofficially. Because if it ever comes out, that's not Kate, that's Pippa. What's the first thing they're going to say? Well, you idiots, we never said it was Kate.
It was an unauthorized photo taken like by a trash tabloid. You know how they love to act like tabloids are trash, even though, baby, they roll around in the trash. It was taken by trash tabloids and not even that, a stupid American tabloid. So tell me how all of the British Rota is on a media blackout. They didn't get this photo at all. Maybe the British people don't care. Like I read somewhere on Twitter, um, you know, Kate's been around for 10 years and the most interesting thing she ever did was go missing. I thought, bum, bum, bum. I thought that was very funny. So when this is dissected and people say, right, that's Pippa. She even has a tan because Kate is not this naturally tan. And that's Pippa and Carol driving. They'll say, oh, the gaudy, stupid American tabloids. How'd they get this story wrong? Are they really that stupid? Are they literally that, gosh, are they really that just dumb? You know how they love talking down to Americans because they realize the royal family just really think Americans are dumb. That's probably why they were so mad that Meghan ran circles around them because she was smarter than everybody combined. That's their plan. Who's falling for this? this is, how did you have this abdominal surgery? that William can't work because you're so going through all this stuff, but yet your mom's driving you around. I thought William was stopping everything to take care of you. I thought William was your rock. I thought you guys were inseparable. It was William. Somebody go look at the rose bushes in Norfolk. Kate Middleton spotted in public for the first time since hospitalization. This is not Kate. This is Pippa. And this is the UK media. Not doing it. The royal sing. And we'll swallow this. If we don't swallow this, they're going to be like, of course it's not Kate. It's Pippa, dummy. We never said it. That was TMZ. But if we swallow it, they'll just quietly let this go. Again, this makes me stand even 10 toes down. Where the F is Kate? Here's what they say in this story. Kate Middleton has surfaced for the first time since her hospitalization early this year and sideline, that sidelined her for a good while. And she's maintaining a low profile or trying to anyway. Again, this is taken out in the middle of the country. The Princess of Wales was seen riding passenger uh, was a, was seen riding passenger Monday in a vehicle that was driven by her mother, Carol, near Windsor Castle in the UK. Again, you saw William freak out. When there was a photographer on one, oi, 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 what are you doing there? Oi, 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 mate, right? Do you really think that photographers were allowed to photo? Again, this is just dumb, anybody that believes this. And like we said, this sighting is a big deal considering we haven't seen her whatsoever since December. Kate is wearing glasses and appeared to be rocking somewhat of a smile here. There didn't appear to be any of the relatives with them in this outing and ditto for security. So let me get this straight. Kate is out riding with her mom with no security by Windsor Castle. And TMZ has a back grid photographer, the same photographers, by the way, that are that literally um, the NYPD found that they were guilty of actually doing what Harry and Meghan said they did in that high speed, high speed chase. These same photographers are out in the middle of the woods taking pictures. With no security, they said it's it, it's almost as if that is Pippa in the car. Because Pippa doesn't get security, as far as I know. It's interesting that she's popping up like this right now. Frankly, the internet has been rife with speculation these past couple weeks over her whereabouts. There's been a lot of jokes made at her, exp at her expense. That was the BBL. One thing about Kate, if you say she has any plastic surgery, mama gonna pop up and be like, oh, excuse me, what are you talking about? You have plastic surgery. What? It is no, uh, there's no surgery plastic, <laughs> no plastic surgery. That's Kate. Point is, people have been wondering where the heck she was and how she's doing, especially since the condition she's been dealing with has been kept under tight wraps, with royal officials only saying she underwent abdominal surgery and nothing else. Buckingham Palace only said at the time that she would remain hospitalized for about two weeks. And after that, she wouldn't be able to resume her duties until about Easter time. They've also reassured the public that she's making progress in her recovery, but not that she's going to make a full recovery, something they reiterated last week when they finally responded to all the viral conjuncture going on. We know Prince William, now this is interesting, has been coming to her side, coming to her side, not been by her side constantly, but 
has been coming to her side throughout all this. Don't they live in the same house? How is your husband going to come by your side when you live in the same house and he dropped all the work to take care of you and the kids? Um, where is he? Prince William has been coming to her side throughout all this. He was seen going to the hospital while she was in there only once. But since then, he's continued to do his work solo. William's only had two engagements. Her father-in-law, King Charles, has also been dealing with his health issues due to his recent cancer diagnosis. But he's been able to carry on just fine, already being seen out and about. Good to see Kate here. Now we all know she's alive and well. Y'all, this was planted. This was the puff piece. And I am going to get to the bottom of this. I swear about it. All right, y'all. Let me know what you think in the comments. But check back to this channel. I'm going to get to the bottom of this because this is BS. I'll talk to y'all later. Bye.